if SQL statements aren't written well, they can be difficult to understand and interpret. So it's important that we consider a few style tips to ensure our SQL is readable, portable, and consistent, among other things. So here's a few tips for doing that. The first is capitalize SQL keywords for readability. So as an example, in this statement, we're capitalizing select, from, and where. It can also be join, group by, having, whatever other keyword we're using, but this makes our SQL statements easier to read and to digest. Then consider using comments for context like you would with other programming languages. So in this case, we're writing a comment with two dashes and we're saying identify our customers from California. That's what this statement is doing. Now you can also write a comment this way. And when we use this syntax, we can uh, designate a multi-line comment. Next, use new lines and indenting for readability. So maybe we have a select statement where we're drawing out, I don't know, seven or eight different columns, and then we've got other things after that. If we write it this way, it's much easier to see and identify those different columns. It really makes it more readable. And then if possible, avoid vendor SQL for portability. There's lots of database vendors out there, some of which have their own SQL dialects. You wanna avoid those so it's portable. You can write a statement here and in some other tool. So here's an example of a SQL statement that's written in traditional SQL, as well as T-SQL, which is a Microsoft dialect. Essentially doing the same thing, just written in a slightly different way. And then with quotes, use single quotes for values and double quotes for columns for consistency. So as an example, in this statement, the full name is the name of the column, and we're asking for filtering for places where the state is equal to CA, that's a value in the table, and we're using single quotes there. So as a summary, capitalize SQL keywords for readability. Consider using comments for context. Use new lines and indenting for readability. And if possible, avoid vendor SQL for portability. And use single quotes for values and double quotes for columns. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, click the subscribe button. And if you're interested in a SQL cheat sheet, you can find one over at codybaldwin.com.